that's fine. Right on time, buddy. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hello. All right. I'd shake your hand, but we're not allowed to. <laughs> there we go. Stephanie. Stephanie? Yeah. How are you? Oh, yeah, we can't do that. Brian? Brian? Misty. Misty, nice to meet you. Oh, I got your message last yeah. night. Yep. Yeah, very cool. Oh, we like What's up? What's up? <laughs> Joshua? <laughs> Long time no see. Yeah, we can't, we can't touch each other much. Sticky holsters, huh? What's up, man? Good. OJ? Nice to meet you. Yeah, we can't. We can't do that. We're in Lincoln. <laughs> All right, everybody. I think everybody's here that's going to be here. Hello, Lily. Hey. How are you? Good, how are you? Good to see you again, Mo. Good to see you. How's it been? Good. How about you? Good. All right, come over here and let's line up. All right. Go ahead. Give me the thumbs up, Josh, when everybody's ready back there. I'll just tell you. How about that? How about that? <laughs> that works, too. Whatever works. Has yep. to be different. Okay, Rocky, go ahead. Ah. Thank you. Stevies, we are on our second group ride. We've got what 10 bikes, I think we just counted. We got Rocky on the mic, he is up there in the front of the group. Of course, Miss Stevie is also connected. It's fun being connected with Rocky because I like the stuff that comes out of his mouth. Yeah, you'll have to edit a lot. All right, he's used to it. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, I got the potty mouth wife here. <laughs> I wondered if you came up to the group and uh, saw how big it was and you started crying. I was pretty shocked when I saw it though. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. Well, the couple behind us, babe. Yeah. They live in Central City. She just friend requested me last night. Oh, they are they from Central City though? Yeah. Oh, okay. They rode all the way from Central City. That's awesome. Man, yeah. that's, one, that's a... one from Utica and a couple from Seward. From Omaha. Yeah, Omaha. So Rocky, now that we got you on your mic, uh, you're you're in the hot seat right now. All right. So uh, tell tell us about yourself. So I bought my first. Uh, well, actually, started riding when I was 16. Bought my first Callis hockey, like most people do. <laughs> Can't afford a Harley, so. Uh, bought a Callis hockey GPZ. First. First of the Ninjas, Crotch Rocket, blasted around that while I was in the Navy. And when I got out, I didn't ride for a while, and then I said, oh, I just need to get back into this, so I bought a Kawasaki Vulcan, and bought that and rode that thing 5,000 miles in the first uh, nine months. So I said, eh, I might as well buy a Harley. So <laughs> back then in 06, you, you got whatever they had for a Harley. So there was an electric light standard. I bought that. Of course, when I left the dealer, it had a radio and gauges in it, so it was just about like a regular electric light. You made a street glide out of it. I made a street glide out of it back then. Yeah, there wasn't a street glide. So. And you put some like awesome flames on it and stuff. I remember that. I did. I went up to uh, Dylan Brothers and they painted it up there. So then Very after cool. that, it was like a. I had that for four years, and then I bought an 11 street glide and a 13 road glide and a 16 road glide. And I'm still <laughs> on the 16 road glide. Off the bike. I think you might be on that one for a while, huh? Yeah, just, just like always, you put too much money into things, but you know, uh -oh. there's always something bigger and better. But this is a nice bike, rides smooth. So, but people that, I like it. But people that buy used bikes love people like us. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> so then Shelly, my wife, that's right behind me on her street glide now, came home one day from a ride with the guys and she said, uh, hey, I want to go look at a bike. I said, I don't need another bike. 
mine. <laughs> he goes, no for me, smart ass. I went, oh, okay. So we went and looked at the sports chair and she rode that around a little bit, crashed it. Humpty Dumpty, we put the bike back together again and she was fine, so. <laughs> and she bought a heritage soft tail. She put about 10,000 miles on that thing. So that was her first trip with that was when we went to Hannibal, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. That was that was fun. Then uh like I said, she put about ten thousand miles on that tank and then I said, you know, you should try this street glide. Just like you just got done talking about after I got done putting you know, expensive speakers on there so she could half ass the hair because I hated it when she had her earbuds in. Yeah. So Put the nice speakers on there, and then we turn around and sold it for a street glide. Now she's driving this rocket gold street glide. She's got 16,000 on it. I remember when she first got that, we went up to uh, Calamus. Oh. Oh. And we're sitting around and we're going, how come this little short blonde chick's got the biggest motor here? <laughs> yep. <laughs> we're like, we can't have this. Yeah, that's kind of why I bought the 16th Street Glide Special. <laughs> the Red Glide Special, because it had the same motor I can't, already equipped with cams. I can't believe the difference between the 103 and the 103 high output that these have. Yeah. Of course, then you get on Amy's 107, and we don't hold a candle to that now anymore either. So. I heard the 14 is even better. Looking at your bars, though, you have inch and a half bars. What what, what are those, Burleys, or what are they? No, these are factory 47s, and I'll tell you what, the, the comfort on these things are just ridiculous. That's awesome. The ergonomics are great. I mean, you can, you're, you said we rode to South Dakota last weekend and deadheaded it straight up there, so we made it in two hours and 45 minutes to yank them. Yeah. And my arms weren't tired at all. Cool. Then I got the hammock seat, which is the next best thing to electricity. Yeah, you know, I, I I think my low rider seat, my low profile seat, is more comfortable than the hammock seat I got. Oh, really? No. Yeah. I don't I, want I, it. It brings me down and back far enough because you know I've got little tiny legs and a tall torso, so yeah. yeah we'll keep telling yourself that. It. <laughs> <laughs> Pause edit delete. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going by the Baker's Candy Place. You want to stop and. Uh, candies no I told my uh, one of the customers I have where I work about that him and his wife stopped here and text me he says thanks man we just spent $77 there <gasps> on candy <laughs> yeah oh my what are they 12 no no they're actually uh, like 70 oh well that actually makes sense there That's... you have it <laughs> I kind of miss this group right so Rocky is like one of the OGs they used to ride everywhere with this. So is Ron and Sandy. Ron and Sandy are up there also. We'll talk to them in a little bit later on. And Shelly. And Shelly. But we used to group ride everywhere. And we every poker run, it was like this little clicky group that we had. Not clicky, but it was this oh, yeah. little group that we had. It was a lot of fun back in the day, you know. Yep. Of course, now you're a member of a riding group called the Rough Riders there in Lincoln. And uh, you group ride all the time now too. <laughs> we do, yeah. So, so I know you keep saying this is a large group, and for you know, for us, uh, a large group is probably 28. Yeah. Wow. So, well, our normal group is me and Amy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so if you guys have seen like when we did Miss Stevie's blinkers on her Fury, Rocky was the one there doing all the wiring, because that man works on airplanes. And if you had to guess, how many miles of wire are in an airplane? Just like a regular uh, company jet, like what you work on. If I had to guess, probably 10 miles. 10 the gosh, dang. That's unreal. Yeah. I mean, that nose cone, you showed us a plane that had the nose cone off of it, and that's where all the radar is, right? Yep, the radar is in the nose cone. So and, just uh, not only detect, obviously, the, the weather and when they're going to hit rain, hail, and what have you. That's, that's, and the, just the, I mean, the size of the little tiny wires is just, I'm looking at that going, dude, use some wire that won't break. <laughs> but yeah. if you do that, you probably raise the, the weight of the plane a lot, don't you? You do. And so when we do new modifications, uh, like new entertainment or new whatever, mm -hmm. new avionics, we'll end up, there's removal. So we take out because otherwise you just, you know, you get too large of a bundle in there and side bolts won't go on and 
interesting fact there is uh, most of the airplanes are put together with Velcro. <laughs> <laughs> the interior, anyway. So you also, when you were in the Navy, you were on the Nimitz, right? I was. I the was aircraft a carrier? Aviation electrician there too. No. Yeah. That's the the size of those ships and what they can do as, absolutely fascinates me. I'm fascinated yeah. with that stuff. The uh, the area of the flight deck was three and a half acres. Oh my gosh. <laughs> What's interesting is there's also cameras on those things that, so you can see all the flight operations. With the hurricane going down around the cape. You can see the waves coming over the top of the bow of that thing. And that's, Are that's, you sh that's, Really? Yeah, that's feet. When you see that. <laughs> <laughs> that thing stands like 30, 40 feet out of the air, out of the water. So when you were in the hurricane in the boat though, did you feel like you were in a hurricane in a boat? Yep. Okay. That was one of the only times that ship rocked. I will say though that looking up there, I get a glimpse of your bike and Shelly's bike every now and then, and I swear your brake lights are on. Yep. I know, that's what I thought. <laughs> we hear that all the time, and I actually put smoke uh, covers on mine. These are <laughs> custom dynamics. Why are they like that? They're, they're custom that dynamics and they're super bright. I can't think of, gosh, are we turning or what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Just wait till you see the brake lights then. Yeah, yeah. It's not a whole big uh, distinguishing difference. <laughs> Oh, well, thanks for leading this group for us again. Hey, we're not done yet. Oh, no, but <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I just kind of just called you and assumed you'd do it. I don't think I ever really yeah. did. Well, I don't do think that. I asked you to do it, but. <laughs> uh huh. Man, that freaking gap gets big. Does it? It doesn't look big from back here, so. Uh, objects, no. objects and mirror are closer than they appear. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Only on the right side. Oh. Oh, I guess on the both sides of the <laughs> I was going to say, it's on my side. <laughs> Whatever, dude. What, I mean, it's your world. <laughs> yep. You know it. <laughs> you got Reinhardt's on yours, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. Shelly's smiling. I don't know what she's saying. <laughs> I just, got my mask. Just, I can't hear her. <laughs> just, just nod and say yes. I did, yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Green. Green means go. Yep, I, yeah. I pulled the Shelly and I revved up my motor behind the car in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> pulled the Shelly? Why yeah. is that a Shelly? Because she does that shit all the time. <laughs> <laughs> to try to get them to go? Yep, if we're sitting at a light and in a second that thing turns green, if they're not moving, she's going to hit the gas. <laughs> like, yeah. Oh man. So just to remind everybody, we are doing this ride because... Uh, Molly who couldn't make it today and Miss Stevie and I think Shelly might have, have been planning on going too but they were going to go over to Carroll, Iowa to break the record for the largest woman's only ride and that got cancelled because of the COVID so we decided to do this instead like I said earlier any day out on the bike is a good day yep that's right I was going to bring the Fury too but I mean I got a lot of stuff to bring but we do have a Fury in the group we do. Because nope. Lily is here again. She's an OG. Mo, she's an OG. Rocky, Shelly. Mo. Oh, Mo, you already said myself. Mo. Yeah. I did. Todd couldn't make it because he had an obligation at a racetrack today. So this highway that we're on here is going to take us up here by the river. And you've seen Miss Stevie and I. We come up here quite a bit to go by the river. But uh, we'll get some drone footage while we're here maybe. And then if you go up there into the hills, uh -huh. it's uh, it's really cool up there. But I'll let the pickup go up there so I can catch up. There you go. <laughs> Leave everybody back. Get <laughs> <Pitch> Shelly off. <laughs>
looks like fun. Ready? Yep. Flat River Rentals. We got to remember that. I think I was right up there and I could only shoot going this way. You told me to do. You did. I did. They're gonna love this. <laughs> Headlights on it now, yeah. and it's crazy the uh, what it does to like the road signs and the street lights and or oh, street yeah. signs and stuff. But... Amy, you want to just pass me? No, we don't Absolutely. have to switch lanes. Okay. <laughs> Absolutely. <What's this? laughs> More the barrier. One, two, three, nope. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen bikes. We were off. <laughs> well, I ran out. Oh. I can't just switch from toes to fingers, man. Oh. <laughs> What's this bike that she's riding in front of me? Uh, I think it's a slim. I think. I uh, know that's a. Uh, Gosh dang it. Street, street Bob. Street Bob's got the narrow front tire, right, Rocky? Yeah. Okay. The big back tire. Because the Fat Bob's got the fat front tire. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that's a Street Bob then. She's a, she's a Dyna Bro. Yep. No, we've got three Road Kings here, don't we? another thing for you guys uh we had uh miss stevie and i were planning a little ride for uh, uh labor day weekend yep. and rocky and shelly are now coming with us yay shelly's taking half a day off friday so is she okay here we are at the big town of Lord. oh yeah the lord the lord and bar the lord wow 41 people not today <laughs> We're gonna do a U-turn. Okay. So we park in front of the bar. All right. We'll go up there and park next to Rocky, I think. Yeah. I left you a spot. Come on up here, sweetheart. There's a bunch of sand up here, so. Okay. You need, to, you need some heels. I do. No. Whoa. You all right? Yeah. No, don't you touch it. Oh, there's <laughs> a lot of gravel there, guys. Whee! Good job. See, that's how women do it. You just yep. get a dude to do it for you. Yep. <laughs> Thank you. Some guys do too. I love do I need it. to leave it in gear? 
Oh, you're fine. Yeah. I love that helmet. Thanks. Air well, flight. Second time I wore it. <laughs> Is it really? Did you have your vents open and stuff? I did halfway here. So if you close your internal visor, if you lower it, yeah. then those vents, you'll feel it right on your forehead then. Well, I always have it closed. No, your internal. Oh, well, I don't know what you're talking about. This one. I didn't know I had that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, whatever. Oh, man. Very cool. All right. Let's see everybody inside. Goodbye. <laughs> Both buttons. I love my that was a lot of fun. Yes, it was. That was, uh, that was, I'm, I'm happy. That was 10 times bigger than I ever thought it was going to be, you know? Yeah. But, uh, so we're going to, we're going to head to the local Harley shop now because I didn't film any while we were in the bar there, which I should have, but I was just having fun talking to people. So, um, we're going to head to the, head to Frontier. I think quite a few people are going to head over there with us, but um yeah so that was group ride number two i don't know if you can see all them bikes behind me or not i guess i can turn this camera on right over to rocky he's just loving it <laughs> he can't even see us why because he's clear in the back oh who's next to me and we had to wait i think oh nope let's go all right so we're gonna end the vlog right here so everybody hit the like button if you like this video, hit subscribe, no, I'm going to end the vlog right here. So everybody, <laughs> so everybody, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to see more stuff like this, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you know when we load up next. And then until next time, everybody stay cool and we will see you on the road.